contestants take your position. Round two is the numbers and logic round. John has three switches. Tom has two switches left to use. John, you'll be going first in this round. Your clock will begin to count down now. Is a kilometer more or less than a mile? More. Less. What is 54.3 minus 28.6? Switch. Switch. Pass. 25.7. John, how long is four hours, 28 minutes, minus one hour, 39 minutes? Switch. Pass. Two hours, 49 minutes. Tom, what is 70 times 0.7? 49. Correct. John, what is 75% of 300? Um, 225. Correct. Tom, in geometry, what is the name for a triangle with three sides of equal length? Equilateral. Correct. John, what is three-fourths minus one-half? Uh... Pass. One-quarter. Subtract the number of feet in a yard from the number of yards in a mile. Uh, seven... Uh, 1757. Correct. Tom, if you are able to collect all 50 state quarters, how much money will you have? Twelve and a half bucks. Correct. John, what is five times 73? Uh, 73. 365. John, you're out of time. Tom, you keep 36.27 seconds to take through to the final round. Well, two thoughts. As we've all seen etched in Sanskrit at the base of the Great Sphinx, subtraction is a bitch. <laughs> also, <laughs> Tom, from a simpler time when men were still manly enough to call a dollar a buck. <laughs> I actually thought John was going to call his dad that we paused so long for uh, one of those questions. It's got to be said. It's got to be said. Five seconds. Tom is up now. You see how Grand Slam it's switched yeah, back? Yeah, flip back there. Because... You're right. He didn't want to call his dad. His dad's the Great Santini. You want to smack him around on that one. Our players are. Exiting the arena now to relax for a moment, so let's talk about where we are so far in this game. What do you got stats-wise, Amanda? Well, statistically, as I say, Tom is now up of five seconds in this game. But it is still anyone's game, Dennis. John is six out of 11, correct, and Tom six out of 12, and both have used two switches, mm -hmm. even Stevens. Let me tell you what I find intriguing about this matchup. Both Tom and John have an H in their first name. But if you lost that H from either of their names, they would still be pronounced John and Tom, so why waste an H? Hey, Grand Slam's gonna return. <laughs> we'll be right back. Coming up, can John reclaim his lead, or will Tom's winning streak continue? It's all after the break on Grand Slam.